So, why are we in Inkapan anyway? We're gonna visit a few friends I know. When you say friends, do you mean- <laughs> The hell? Another one that ain't no spy this guy! Easy, easy, Ariki. He's with me. That's the boy I was talking about. Another one. Come with me. This is Araki. She's the princess of the Yamamoto Ninja Clan. Pleased to meet you, Hime. You must be... Kikan san I'm actually his son. Haruki, nani is teru? You seem very familiar. Please, if you could follow me. My father told me stories of the legendary ninja warrior from the Yamamoto clan. I just thought they were just bedtime stories. Hmm. I would tell you another story. One from long ago. I was barely an assassin when the Federation Army attacked my clan. Me and my sister were the only survivors. I was very weak and sick when the Federation captured us. They made my sister watch my execution. I'll never forget those tags. My father? Yes. At that time, he was his disavowed soldier. Yet he secretly entered Squid Nam to fight off the people of Squid Nam and the Federation. Brother, we need to keep moving. Die in the name of. Cut him loose. The Federation was forced to retreat. Your father was a good man. After that day, I dedicated my life not to only know the ninja ways, but to master the art of modern warfare. I swore that no one would ever threaten my clan ever again. I only wish I could have repaid my debt to your father. It's not too late, Yamato. 
uh, I know wherever he is, he's grateful for whatever thing that you've done for him. I promise you, his death will not go in vain. You are my clan's honor and respect, Troy son. Please tell me you found him. We tried everything, Logan. He hasn't used his emergency transponder. We even tried to find his distress signal, but it's offline. So, that means he might be dead. Whoa, whoa. Let's not think like that. He could be alive. Or maybe they took him out of the country. You're not helping, Callie. No, Murray. Callie does have a point. I even checked his phone, and it seems like it's offline. What do you think of this, Murray? Hmm. It could be true. Maybe the captain knows. Try speaking to him. Alright then. Well, just be warned, he's not really in the best mood. I'll take my chances. For hell's sake, whatever problem you have, do it your- Logan? So... What's a guy like you doing here? We have a problem, Three. Troy's been taken by the Shadow Raptures. We haven't heard from him ever since. I know you and him are close. We could really use your help. No. What? But I thought he was your friend. We aren't friends. We never were and never will be. What about two years ago? I didn't need his help. He's an absolute shithead. I can see why Eight doesn't talk to him as much. Brandon, I don't give two ink sacks what you think about him. And I don't give two shits if you're a higher rank. But you're not gonna fucking disrespect one of my family members. And what if I do? Then I'll gladly murder you on the spot. Fine, I'll help him. But if I help, you two owe me big time. You won't regret it. Thank you. Delta, listen up. As you may have been aware, or haven't, the commander has been declared MIA. At this time, we don't know if he's dead or alive. But right now, we're teaming up with a new Squid Bakes platoon. Yes, the captain of the NSS, former Agent 3. So you will treat them as your own. It's time we take back our commander. Splara, let's get to work. <laughs>